High school baseball, Northview entertaining Clay. Bottom of the first, Wildcats with men on first and third. Riley Ames delivers the liner into right. Benny Seal scores as Northview plates two in the bottom of the first. Eagles rally though, top of the fourth. Clay down 3-2, man on third for Christian Mays. Hard hit ball gets into left field. Ethan Stager crosses home. We are tied at three. Go to the seventh. Eagles now down a run, two on, one out. Donovan Coughlin facing Alex Primus, grounds to third. Wildcats take the out as May scores, so the game is tied at four. Go to the bottom of the seventh. It's what every kid dreams about. Tie game, bases loaded, full count, and Primus at the plate atones for allowing the tying run to score. The base hit to left brings in Ames. Northview wins it 5-4, dramatic fashion, thanks to Shohei Primus. Gets the win of the mound and drives in a pair. Yeah, I was very nervous at bat going up there after they uh, intentionally walked both of them. I was nervous. I fought off pitches, and I knew I had to uh, make up for my uh, mistakes in the top of the inning. And, yeah, I hit it, and I knew it was a base hit. I got it in, and uh, basically, yeah, teammates came out. It was a very good moment. With more on that very good moment and several other moments in tonight's game, we turn to Tim Clagg and Rhett Boyd. The Northview Wildcats had 20 extra base hits last week during their spring trip to Florida. And those early tests prepared them for their home opener in 2022. Bottom of the seventh inning, game on the line, insert senior Alex Primus, and he was up and ready for the challenge. Yeah, he really was. In that trip to Florida, they got a lot of reps in a very short period of time to prepare for games like this. They got into some situations where they play situational baseball late in the ball game, and they were able to do it, come up big with that big hit by Primus late. It's a big win for them in their home opening. It's a very good Clay Eagle baseball team. A tremendous pitching effort today from Aiden Hall. Last year, he missed the majority of the season with a pinched nerve in his back, and he was comfortable in this game recording five strikeouts. Yeah, I thought he did an outstanding job. He got this team off to a good start early on, but really shutting down this offense of, of Clay. He had a good, firm fastball. He challenged guys up in the zone. He had a lot of success, and I think it allowed his team to settle in in what was, you know, nerve-wracking, you know, home opener, playing a quality opponent. He did an outstanding job on the bump today for the Wildcats. Coach Phillips for Clay wanted more offensive production from his team and he found it today from his six through nine hitters they combined for four hits yeah i thought that's an outstanding job for them because the hits have been hard to come by for this group early on in this season you know what you're going to get out of your top four guys on most days it's when you can establish length in your lineup when you can put it all together that's when you can have some special seasons offensively so if he can get that production from the top as well as the bottom like you did here this, this afternoon uh, you know this team will be tough to come by a hard beat in the track. Northview off to a red hot start. They move to six and one. Clay falls now to two and four.